It looks like the Philippine Marine Corps will be receiving a modified variant of the BrahMos anti-ship missile coastal defense system to suit its limited budget. The Philippine Department of National Defense (DND) signs a US 375 million United States dollars contract for the acquisition of the BrahMos medium-range supersonic cruise missile. The induction of the BrahMos missile into the Philippine Marine Corps will strengthen hand maritime capability and will also contribute to collective maritime security within the region, Admiral Kumar was quoted as saying instead of mobile firing units with three BrahMos anti-ship missile tubes each, the model shown below and displayed in the Philippine Marine Corps Coastal Defense Regiment's headquarters only show two missile tubes. This means less ready missiles per battery for the Philippine variant. A typical Indian BrahMos coastal defense battery consists of four missile firing units with three missiles each, bringing a total of 12 ready-to-fire missiles per battery. Meanwhile, Max Defense PH believes that based on the project cost of the PMC shore-based anti-ship missile system acquisition project, a typical Philippine BrahMos coastal defense battery may only have a maximum of four missile firing units with two missiles each, or a total of eight ready-to-fire missiles per battery, or a minimum of three missile firing units with two missiles each, or a total of just six ready-to-fire missiles per battery. This is exactly what happened to the sum acquisitions by the Philippine Army and Philippine Air Force lately, which either modified the system or reduced the quantity of the firing units to suit the low budget. A typical Atmos 155mm self-propelled howitzers battery of the Philippine Army only has four howitzers instead of six while a typical Spider Mr. Air Defense battery of the Philippine Air Force only has three missile firing units with four missiles each instead of six missile firing units with eight missiles each and using a less powerful radar. The Philippine Army is also lining up to acquire two BrahMos batteries for coastal defense missions under the third horizon of the Revised Armed Forces of the Philippines Modernization Program, RAFPMP, which runs from 2023 to 2027. If the PMC indeed receives missile firing units with only two missile tubes each, we hope that it can be modified to carry three missiles in the future should more budget be allocated for improving the systems.